Jay is back with another daily video for you guys. And if you look here right on the screen, I literally earned 0.72 Great British Pounds. That is $1 in literally five minutes of work. I'm gonna show you exactly in this video how to do this. I've got proof each and every step that you need to take. So it's important that you watch this until the end that you can earn exactly this amount of money right now. I literally earned this five minutes ago um, just before I recorded. So this is the proof in my account and let's get straight into the video. And this website right here, triaba.com, you can respond to paid online surveys and earn between 50 US cents and $5.50 for each survey that you complete. Now the longer the survey, the more you're going to earn. And some surveys may take five minutes, some may take about 20 minutes. And obviously, the 20 minute ones are going to take a lot longer and if you look at the top right you can see there is a other countries tab and I mean you can set it to any country that you're at so for example I'm in South Africa so I can set my country to South Africa and it will actually change the currency for you so I can respond to surveys paid uh, paid surveys online and earn between 5 and 445 Rand um, which is equivalent to five dollars and you can see if you come over to the payments tab um, it will tell you what you can earn and what you need to withdraw this money straight to your PayPal account this is a PayPal money method it's paid straight to your PayPal account um, and you can see you can earn between five or no 50 and five dollars for completing one survey only and you need a maximum of five dollars in your account before you can make a withdrawal so in my case 75 Rand and your money will be transferred to your online account uh, via PayPal within one to four business days so this website pays anytime it's not like it only pays once a month you can withdraw anytime um, and you can see um, the panelist reward model. So a survey from not two minutes may take or may give you about 0.16 Great British Pounds. Um, you can see a survey that pays or up to 36 minutes is about 2.80 Great British Pounds, which is equivalent to about $5, um, which is really good pay. I mean, it's not bad at all. And you can see if you come over to your, and you can see if you come over to the login panel, you will be prompted with your account, your profile, um, such as your travel, healthcare, media, auto, uh, business to business questions that I have for you, food and beverage. So what you're going to do is uh, when you come over to the login tab, you're going to have to sign up an account with your name, uh, I think email and password, and it's going to pop up with a profile like this, where it's got your profile, um, different various settings and you can see they've got travel seven questions for you to answer and what you want to do is you want to answer as many of these questions as possible so you basically want to answer all of these to make your profile look as good as possible so that you will get more and more surveys um, on the survey tab so you can see if I click on the survey tab I've at the moment got two surveys available so I've got a 13 minute survey that I can do for 0.72 great British pounds which is equivalent to one dollar so one dollar in 13 minutes of work is really not bad pay at all considering you're just answering a couple of questions online um, and then I've got another 18 minute survey for 1.04 Great British Pounds which is equivalent to about 1.82 dollars for 18 minutes of work which is really not bad so I mean this does pay well it's not like it's only a couple of cents it's actually paying a couple of dollars and then you can come over to the survey tab and you can complete survey so let's for example I want to click on this survey it will take me to a survey page uh, let's just wait for this to open it's going to ask me for, uh, yeah, we care about your privacy. So just you've got to agree to like the whole privacy terms and conditions um, and that sort of thing. So I'm going to agree with that. And here you can see here the survey started. So this survey is about clothes um, and shopping behavior. And we are interested in your thoughts and attitudes towards clothes. So I'm going to continue with this. And you can see, please state your year of birth. So just enter this information. Are you male or female? What region do you live? Eastern Cape. Um, obviously, I'm in South Africa. What companies that sell clothes are you aware of? So you can go literally go to Google and you can go companies um, that sell clothes. And if you don't know of a lot of companies here, yeah, you can just use these. So you can use, uh, for example, Nike, Adidas, uh, you can go Gucci, <laughs> Coach, American Eagle, and you can also go, and you can also go Michael Kors. That should be enough for this one. So go next. Um, from which companies would you consider buying clothes for yourself? So let's say uh, Gucci, Adidas, Adidas, and Nike. Okay. And then we can go, what company do you prefer to buy clothing from? Um, so the number one, let's just say Nike. And we go next. And you can see, where did you last buy clothes for yourself? So if you want to answer, let's just say Nike again, um, for example. And how did you make this last purchase? Let's just go in store. And where your, were your clothes purchased new or second hand? You can either enter new or second hand. Um, how well do you know the following companies? Woolworths, I've made a purchase in the last 12 months. Markham, I am not familiar with the company. Mr. Price, I've made a purchase. I know of Mr. Price. Edgar's, Trueworths, I know them. H&M, Cotton On, 
Um, so, I mean, these questions will obviously be related to shops and that in your country. Um, and you can see below, you'll be presented with a number of statements regarding how you might feel about different things in life. So spending time with family is more um, important than being successfully at work. I generally completely agree. I make responsible choices for society and planet. Um, I just give myself an eight. I consider myself to be an energetic and outgoing person. Give myself a nine. It is important to stick with traditional values and habits. I'll give myself a six. I mean, just answer, you know, genuinely, and you'll prompt me with more questions. So it is important for me to buy clothes from brands that do good for society. Um, I give myself an eight. I always think what, what to wear. So no matter the occasion, uh, I give myself a six or I give myself a seven. I'm willing to pay a higher price for high quality clothes. I give myself a six. Um, I always prioritize from practically financially of a good looking design. I give myself a six again. Uh, I always feel confident in what to wear regardless of what other people think. 10, I'm willing to pay extra for sustainably produced uh, clothes. Give myself an eight. I mix and match clothes from different price levels. Yes, I do. So 10, just answer genuinely and keep going. And how likely is it that you would recommend the following brands to a friend or colleague? Woolworths, yes. Mr. Price, eight. Edgar's, nine. Uh, Trueworths, seven. H&M six, cotton on six. And you can enter that and go next. And you can see it's taken me to the complete page. So thank you for completing our survey. Your time and thoughtful responses are greatly appreciated. Your reward will be automatically credited to your account. To check your account, log in here. Um, so I'm gonna click here to log in. Uh, and you can see I am now on my account. And if I go to rewards, um, you can see my balance is now 0.72 Great British Pounds. So that means I've earned $1 in literally, that was took me like five, 10 minutes of work. Um, so although the survey said um, 13 minutes of work, it maybe only took me five minutes. So and here we go, $1 in just 13 minutes of work.